going on YouTube? Splitting wigs. Back with another video. Shoot house gameplay. Got in late. Playing by myself. No squad. Throwing the buys in here. Gun I don't use too much of, but uh, I'm going to start try to start ranking it up. You know, eventually I'll probably end up trying to go for some gold submachine guns. But this is a weird gameplay. Um, team goes from camping hard, and then once they get their streaks, they start trying to actually play the objective, but uh, pretty boring in the middle, though. I don't know what people's addiction is with uh, sitting around and not really playing the objective. I don't know. It's just so boring, It's and so many people do it, it's just so weird. Put on my buys, and I got the regular sights. Rocking the 5 milliwatt laser. Uh, no stock. Speed it up a little bit because for a submachine gun, it, it's a little bit of a slow playing gun. Uh, it ADS is a little slow. It, movement speed's a little bit slow because of all the ammunition. But uh, if you run no stock, it speeds it up a lot. If you run the whatever grip you want, it kind of helps aim. I mean, like right here, it's pretty accurate. I mean, I almost get all three of them. Which, you know, if I'm rolling the MP5, I'd probably get all three, but it's hard to say. But, what about you guys? Anybody on got a Bison setup they can suggest since I'm going to be playing with it for the next couple nights? Just down in the uh, comments, let me know. Let me know how you run this gun and might help me like it a little bit more. It's not bad, just definitely not my favorite. A mad frag skills. As you can see, at first they were pushing B, they were actually trying to cap stuff and, uh, you know, kind of play aggressive. I thought this was going to be a fun game. Then, the last 30 seconds, a minute, and everybody kind of just disappears. <laughs> And uh, you'll see here in a minute, they're all just sitting in our spawn and sitting in this wood building, just in corners. I don't know. Very weird. Yeah, this is terrible. I don't know how I didn't see that person. Yeah, and they're using shotguns too. Yeah, they even go upstairs here in the office, camping in the office, camping in their spawn. And it's okay. I mean, it makes for an easy win. I mean, you don't have to worry about you know, losing the game, but just makes play Office. slow and kind of boring. Time to snipe with a grenade. Watch, I think I hit him with this one. Right now, come on. That's a good way to attack C when you're losing it right there, too. If you guys jump on that wall, it, uh, it's a lot safer than turning that corner. You can usually pick guys off pretty good. Oh, get turned on, yo! Oh! Pop my dead silence, try to get running here. And... Corner camper. <laughs> One thing, see right there, that uh, tack laser on the other team, you could see that the whole time. Or, no wait, the tack laser, you only see when someone's ADSing. Whereas the 5 milliwatt laser that I'm running, if you're full sprint, you don't see it, and uh, which makes it nice. Did you see that Kobe grenade, by the way? There's so many good grenade throws on this map. I mean, if you watch this gameplay, just watch some of the angles and some of the grenade throws I use. It's just an easy way to get actually a lot of kills. Um, roll shrapnel, two frags, you know, people camp, it's easy to throw grenades to where they're at usually, especially on this map. <laughs> Sitting in a corner. I guess some people like that, but uh, damn, I just, I know I can't do that. The game does pick up here, though. One of these guys that are camping, look at that, ADSing, just standing on top, <laughs> camping.
camp. And, but yeah, as soon as I get their uh, kill streaks here, like one grenade. Pretty much every every life, I almost get a kill with the grenade. And still chilling. Just ADS in this turn. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Whatever. See, they pop this VTOL, and they get a chopper gunner, and then they actually do push and try to get some objectives, but this grenade bounce right here goes both ways. You can actually bounce that, get it over the walls, back to the where that guy was just camping, which is why I ran to there, actually. When he killed me and he was camping around the corner there, that's a good grenade throw. Just run over by the red containers. That's a good bounce. That gets it right to where he was standing, but he must have moved. Same thing works from this side. If you turn that corner, you can actually bounce that same wall and uh, get a grenade back in by the containers for whenever you're playing, especially hard point and uh, headquarters whenever the objective's there. It uh, comes in handy, for sure. Right here, I'm just protecting myself from the uh, Harrier. You know, there's no sense just running out and dying. I mean, we got 148 to 73 lead. I mean, I went out to protect B right there, but here's another thing. Grab that pistol and get to cover. You know, it just... There's no reason to... Oh, get bodied. Get bodied, son. Look at that. Clearing B. B toll in the air. 1v3. Sorry, Thunder, for using your catchphrase, but... But they did. They, in fact, got bodied. Ah, so. come Yeah, this is where it gets nutty. Keep pushing. But, you know, they probably think if they camp for your streaks that they can maybe come back and win this, but it's next to impossible to win 166 to 84. I mean... You know, they can't sit the entire game and expect to have a chance just because they got a couple kill streaks. Especially when you got idiots like me that'll actually <laughs> still play the objective with shit, with uh, kill streaks in the air. I should have stemmed right here. I don't know what I was doing. I should have just paused a second and stemmed when I was heading to that jump spot. But this is a good class too. I mean, uh, if you guys, I ended up didn't need to switch to it, but uh, you should put together a kill streak. I can maybe go over that in a future video, but you should always have a kill streak that's specific for just uh, taking out kill streaks. Yeah, I run the uh, some sort of a heavy mach uh, light machine gun. I think the PKM's the best, uh, and then I usually have a launcher, and I run uh, you know Ghost, and I run uh, the first perk for so that the uh, kill streaks can't see you, and you know it's. In this game, it's super easy. I mean, the, they have the kill streaks nerfed so bad in this game. I mean, it's so easy to take out a, a kill streak. Um, you know, it's free point. It's easy points. You know, so definitely worth looking into. I'll make a video on it. You know, you don't just sit there and keep dying or have to hide from kill streaks. In this game, it's so easy to uh, take them out that there's no sense just camping or hiding from it. You can't even cross center in this map usually. You get at least one, if not two, people camping that center line, which to each their own, but man, that's got to be boring. Just I saw a guy the other night just tacking in to the jump spot back here because he just wanted to stay right there the whole map, you know. <laughs> oh well. Oh, here we go. Splitting wigs, point horn like he always does. I'll take some free points at the end of the game. But nothing special. Yeah, I'd, I'd, top player and scorer. It was, got, got a little boring in the middle of that match, but you know, it's a good way to show you know, a certain game style to try to make sure you win. Oh, look at this. I forgot I got to play the game here. But, like it, subscribe, and always comment. Let me know what you think and what to change.